How are you doing today? Would you like a bayonet to the face? Yes, I would, Baron. Please bayonet me in the face. All right, everybody. Baron here, and welcome back to Rise of Liberty. Now, you know what's funny is look at this. This is Jerry's tent. Remember Jerry? Well, I think that's funny how the devs were like, oh, well, this is Jerry's tent. You know, I like that. I like those little bits of detail. And, like, it's fun to see when developers are kind of paying attention to the YouTubers, right? And uh, and just like us as a community but over here at Baron's Brigade. So anyway, they've added some new things. We will get into it. Ooh, do we want more enemies? Well, just like slightly more enemies. Well, anyway, you can do that. Wow, how do you make it balance? Number of waves. Oh my God, endless waves? All right, gentlemen, let's just charge. So you may notice some pointy bits on the end of our muskets here. Look at these. Our brilliant revolutionary soldiers here. We are heading towards the flag here, so we're gonna get a little bit ahead of our men. I love to see that there is development going into this game, and that there's constant, like, little bits of improvements. Like, look at this. Boop boop. Now we compress. Oh. And we hide the HUD. How amazing is that? We can also look at the flag and fire! But there's bullet drop now. Or would it be musket ball drop? I don't know, but you know, it's like when you take something and you gotta celebrate, everybody needs to fire in the air. Once we take this flag, celebrate! But you did get to see the musket ball. Holy crap, that was actually pretty cool. Well, my guys aren't celebratory with me, but I guess they're staying frosty, and I, and I can't fault them for that. That is how I train them. That was a test! And you gentlemen have passed it brilliantly. But yeah, so now that we've got bayonets, we're gonna stonewall Jackson, these red coat lobster backs. Oh, I can hear muskets. Look at this. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna... I'm gonna get with the main formation here. The main body. It sounds like there's a battle happening over the other side of that hill. But I want to be with the men. Oh, God. We are confronting the British. Like, they're right there. You see the musket? Oh, no! We've taken... Oh, that was devastating. I think the British got the first salvo. Look at that. There's bullet drop now we have to count for. Oh, God. All right, I'm, I'm not, I'm not, oh my God, my men are getting wrecked. And look, reinforcements, and we've got two reinforcements and they've got like freaking 20. All right, let's see what's going on over here. Cause this looks like a lost cause. There's just, there's just too many. Oh, whoa, they're bayonet charging. Hold the phone. I need a charge too. Ah. Oh my God. All right, I redeployed and look, where's Jerry's tent? Jerry, are you sleeping on the job, man? Wake up, Jerry. All right, Jerry seems to be out in the field of battle. I just spit on my monitor. I need to deal with that. Whoa, what are these guys doing? Oh, so the British have slowly taken the hill, and our men are just forming a line over here. I'm not sure what these guys are doing. They're forming a column, almost. Look at this. Gentlemen, prepare. You know what? You're not leading your soldiers into battle, sir. You've been relieved of command. Now you, you men, you need to fight. Who are, you know what? I can't kill all of my men. Oh God, Never mind, men. You will, you will protect me. Look at this guy. I don't know. The British shot him. It wasn't me. Go gentlemen, go. Oh God, they're getting surrounded. It's a massacre. What are you doing? So clearly uh, my men are, 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 ooh, wait a minute. Hold on, let's see if we can't. We can't bayonet charge from the side. I'm, I'm gonna melt Gibson these guys. Oh, they're already dead. See that? Oh my god, I got shot by a musket ball. I got shot twice. But there's redeployment, and I love that. All right, we're back here. It would be cool if you could, um, in the future, redeploy at the different flag points. I still want a Bunker Hill map. That's like a different scenario where you kind of like, once you're able to set up different kinds of scenarios and different kinds of like, I guess you could say AI fighting styles, right? Defensive or offensive, right? I would love to do a Bunker Hill map. That would be so cool. Basically, that is where these beautiful blue-coated revolutionaries... Gentlemen! They're like, get out of the way, Baron! You noob! And I'm like, I'm your officer! Don't call me a noob, sir! But... Where they would, like, sit in this, like, in, like, some trenches and some cool, like, bunkers made out of, like, trees and logs and stuff like that. Maybe some cannons? Oh my god, where are the cannons? I can't wait for the cannons! Gentlemen! The British suck! As Sun Tzu once said, probably, screw those other guys, we're better than them. 
You know, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure that Sun Tzu, one of the most, like, quotable military theorists of his age. Oh my god, there are the British. Oh, and they're just gunning down some skirmishers here. Hold on. What's up, dude? What's up, dude? You dead? Nope. I must have hit someone's backpack. So this is kind of cool. We have this, like, stalemate here where both sides are just rallying up forces and waiting till they have the critical bit. Oh god, the British are coming. One if I land, two if I get riggedy riggedy wrecked, sir. Gentlemen, the British are coming. Does nobody listen? The frickin' British, they're coming. I got, I got the guy behind the one I was aiming at. All right, we, we've got to, we've got to hold with our lines here. Prepare your butts. Wait, is that a retreat over here? Do we have a retreat? Or you, no, you're coming in to reinforce. Get in line, gentlemen. The British are here. I hope I got that guy. Oh my god, I missed. There is bullet drop now. Oh, come on, men. Oh no. I think we may have gotten the first salvo. Let's see. But dude, isn't this epic? I'm gonna wait till they fire their bayonets. I shouldn't stand behind my men. I'm like the officer, kind of like, all right, it's fixed bayonets time. Go, gentlemen, go. Oh no, they're just moving up. Oh god, the British are flanking on the right side. This is getting crazy. They're reloading as they're charging. Charge! Oh no, I gotta reload. Oh wow, wow, wow. Frame rate drop. Frame rate drop. I think... I'm not sure if it's the bayonets or what. Maybe it was... I got hit. Maybe it was a, a, a perfect storm of things. Look at this. Get them, boys! Ah! They got me! Oh my god, they got me. Alright, so let's spectate a bit. This is really cool. This is great for just kind of appreciating what's going on the battlefield and also making you wonder, well, you know, what would happen if someone had a gyrocopter or a scout plane or a drone during the Revolutionary War? Oh boy. The British are making a nice little tactical flank here. Look at this. That is just an app. That's a battlefield and a half right there. The British are trying to get here, but my forces, I told them to do this, you know, as a, as a general, I get all the credit and if something goes wrong, I get to blame my, um, inferior officers, right? Isn't that how it works? As that's true leadership. You never take responsibility for anything. I'm pretty sure that's how it goes. But anyway, our men are winning, too, by a score of about 60-plus. So these two flag bearers are like, why did I- why was I equipped with a flag and not a gun? Yeah, there's like two flags. Come on, boys. Finish off the Brits. And then we can go about our day. There goes one flag bear. Okay, so it kind of like scroll wheel helps. Look at this. I hope my men are not firing into the ground, but the British don't seem like they've taken many casualties. I can only assume that the accuracy there, these guys need to be retrained, but look at this. This is where the real action's happening. And it's really cool to see how there's like a proper line battle area, and then there's the little skirmishes on the side. I think since the last update though, the AA may have been tweaked a little bit, probably to account for it to allow them to, quote, bayonet charge. Fix bayonets! Charge! Oh, that guy got shot right in the face as he was closing the distance. Oh, no, this is not good. Wait, actually, we kind of, we kind of charged him, like, Napoleon style in a column. But, like, I think that it'd be really cool to see if you could form, like, almost like Total War style. Oh, my God. This is the beginning. Okay. Developer. People. This is it. This is the magic right here. What we're seeing here is basically... Now, have you ever played Empire Total War? Where you control giant units and you draw, like, you, you kind of set your formations, you have them charge. There's dragoons who are men on horses who dismount. Look at this guy. He's like, King of the Hill! I'm claiming it! But then... The only, the, the difference would be, you have that total war, look at these guys. Hello sir, would you like a sport of tea? Blah! How about a bayonet to your gussets? Oh god, the British are coming. But, you, you basically have the strategic overview, and the tactical overview, but then, you get to go and be one of the soldiers. That is what I would do with this game. Oh god, the British are flanking. The British have drastically caught up, you know what, so we need to get out there. We need to help our men. This, this line here is getting flanked on the right, and the British are forming up in the center. Oh god, and who's this guy? What are you doing over here, dude? 
This is, you're in the wrong neighborhood, son. This is my neighborhood. We have New England clam chowder over here. We got cheese baggers. We got baseball. We've got rugby with forward passing, also known as football, where you rarely put your foot on the ball. But that's what we got going over here, you Brits. And they're like, oh man, we want some of that. That's why we have NFL games in London. I mean, why do they have NFL games in London? I'm gonna, oh, you don't even, no! You know, I've never really explored the sides of the map. I wanna be attacked by Krakens, or have like pirate ships, not pirate ships, ship of the line. Sh Age of Sail type ships, schooners, galleons. I guess galleons are those. Those aren't really still used, right? Frigates. Uh, first class, second class, third class. You know, ships of the line, things like that. I'm gonna try to make a flanking maneuver. I hope the AI doesn't detect me. If they do, I'm gonna have to swamp Fox Francis Marion. There. There's two enemy soldiers. One's got a flag. Make that three. They're kind of rallying there and then getting out, getting out of dodge. Don't even look at me. You lobster back. Oh god, what are you looking at, dude? Took you out first! I took you out first! Fix bayonets! Fix bayonets! Yeah! Alright, I'm gonna have to take this single-handedly, which is going to be difficult. We took a- We took a musket ball to our left calf. There's a- There's a British man there. Hide behind the trees. Till we reloaded. Oh, he shot me in the heart! Well, I dare say... The Brits, what they did was they absolutely crushed the center, right? And look at this. Where? Oh, oh, the British victor. Yeah, they crushed the center here. Oh, they took the camp. Look at that. While I was out going on a secret mission, I wasn't defending the camp. And they just charged through and destroyed us. Ladies and gentlemen, this is terrible news. All right, I have Benedict Arnold over here. We have no Jerry's over here. We have Thomas's. Thomas, where are you, sir? Your collar is out of order, sir! Oh my god! What just happened? I just collateraled! How do you- what? How did I do that? How- uh, is this thing loaded with like- Is this a, like a shot? What just happened? My mind is blown. We lost two great men to inferior collars. They didn't press them. And that cannot be tolerated in Her Majesty's service. Now, is it His Majesty at the time? God save the king. God save the king! What does Tory mean? Isn't that a word? There's like all these British words. Now, when I was in London, it was funny. I'm, I'm, I'm kind of spacing on a little bit of it. Ooh, is this a hole? No. It's funny how, like, in a lot of cases, the British seem to have, like, a very formalized, you know, verbiage. Ooh, we've got to... Ooh, they're taking over there. We've got to... I've got to be over here. This is... This is the critical moment. If we can take this spot, then, you know, we're gonna win. I just believe that we will win. Alright. I don't think I want to snipe just yet. I want to be with my men. I want them to take the muskets. Oh, we're kind of charging in. Who's getting more shots, us or them? That's right, dude. I shouldn't shoot the guys who are reloading. I should shoot the guys that are about to fire. But we are forming a line. Form a line. Form a line. Fight the good fight. We need to tax these people without giving them representation. We need to protect our T-boats. Come on, gentlemen. Oh, dude. That's Jerry's cousin, Larry. He, he was a good man. He had a wife. Eight kids. We're taking it. Let's take the flag. Are there any reinforcements for these colonists? Let's see if this magical pistol can do it again. Nope. Retreat! Shoot this man! He's chasing me! Nice work, nice work. I like the officer's pistol, or rather just the secondary. I feel like in the next one there should be, like, officers. Oh, oh my god, I thought that was the enemy for a second. I, I, it freaks me out. The enemy is winning in score, but I think that's because they held this flag. Now, if I press M, look at these guys. Look at that. They've surrendered! It's the French flag, and now it's back to the British flag. Oh god. Ooh, Hessian mercenaries! Dude, I want all kinds of things. All right, let's see if we can't. Who, do we have any men? We do. We do. We've got a few good men to flank the colonial main line right here, which is actually just dead already. But there is some bayonets going on. If that guy's alive by the time I get there, I'd be surprised. Look, there's just one guy with a flag. He's like, hello there, Zeth. How are you doing today? Would you like a bayonet to the face? Yes, I would, Baron. Please bayonet me in the face. Sir, I've got a flag. He's punching me. He punched me. I didn't know he could attack! That's amazing! Oh my god, look at that. 
a huge reinforcement wave here. Come on, boys. I guess we're they're dealing with bayonet charges. Bullet drop my buttocks. Oh my god, they're looking at me now. All right, you know what? We're gonna we're gonna go with these guys. Come on, come on, boys. We we can't lose with with numbers of. There's an entire six of us going up against the entirety of the enemy formation. Good lord. Oh, wait, wait, hold on. No! I was gonna move in on that flanky force. Anyway, guys, so this is pretty cool. I do like that there's the spectate option now. I'm not sure if we're gonna win. I'm not sure if it's the map layout or basically what I did, but look at this. Oh, God. The British definitely need a drastic reforming. It looks like the Colonials are doing a little bit better. At least over here. The Brits seem like they're winning over here. Actually, this is pretty neck and neck, except for those reinforcements. And actually, that's a pretty heavy amount of reinforcements as well. But it seems the British might get there. I thought they would get there a little early, but it, it, they might get there actually a little late. Oh, where'd this guy come from? There's a few survivors over here. They're like in two spots. Look at that bayonet charge. Oh, the British are gonna get here. Nice, they're taking them out. You've got to get to the flag, though, guys. You've got to get to the flag. I'm telling you, man. Rise of Liberty could be Empire Total War mixed with Ravenfield muskets. And you would have yourself a game and a half. That would be pretty epic. That would take a lot of time to develop, but I dare say it'd be worth it. I think that I'm going to give the Colonials the edge here. Actually, no. The British are getting this, like, concave firing circle and starting to knock them out. And they're getting reinforcements pretty quickly. Colonials, not as much. They're getting distracted up here. So I'm going to say that this one could be a British victory. Ah. Anyway, my name is Baron, everybody. Thank you for watching Baron's Brigade. Where are you at? How was your weekend? What games were you playing? What games should I check out this week? And you know what, guys? I will see you in the next video.